makeup video time. Ooh. I swear I look like a 12 year old boy. Or just a 12 year old with boobs. Yeah. Figured I'd film myself putting on makeup. I haven't worn makeup in like over a week. I like the start with this. It's my favorite. And I like the tingle. Burt's Bees Peppermint. Um. is doing makeup videos for Luminous Cosmetics. Um, I guess I'll do one too. But she wants me to use your, her stuff. But I like NYX. Let's see, I have a lot of this stuff. I have the eyeliner, the eyeshadow. Oh, that was actually, that was mascara, eyeshadow. I think it's the Phoenix set. Um, epic eyeliner. Recently I got the white one, but yeah, I use a lot of that. Even the finishing spray. Hmm. I already put this on. I'm almost out. It's rose water and vinegar, but I like just rose water. It's good for uh, when you feel just dry and ill. I always remember to wash your hands before putting on your makeup. You don't want pimples. Pimples suck. This is the foundation. This one in particular is alabaster, but my favorite is porcelain. But it seems like porcelain, alabaster, and vanilla sometimes, if I want color, is my color from them. Okay. No, not that. Let's see if I can put some... Uh... nondescript music on just won't get flagged melancholy music dark forest mysterious dread okay play Where, where's play play all oh my gosh it's like gone it's way better fucking ads your butt. No, I don't need green. Uh, what was I doing? Yeah, it's my first time doing this without at least something on my face other than rose water spraying. Well straight from the shower it's water, it's soap. I wash my face with the uh, cleanser and then after a shower I put uh, lotion. I lotion everywhere. You gotta stay moisturized. And then after that I spray the rose water and then I put the chapstick on and then if I'm putting makeup on I use this. And this is how I do it. Yes, I know I should have put the headband more on my forehead, but... Ugh. I dab here, 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 here. I know they make like concealer for right here, but I always forget to get it. Uh-oh. It's very watery. I'm just gonna do my usual, not too much out of the box, but I'll also take pictures later, post them on my Instagram. My Instagram is Ragdoll Fairy. I've been using the username Ragdoll Fairy 27. <sighs> Shit, since I was like, fuck, 17. It changed over time, but I mean. 
It's always been Ragdoll Fairy 27. For Facebook, MySpace. Y'all yeah, remember MySpace, right? MySpace. Um, rest in peace. Uh, oh, Vampire Freaks. I miss it. But it went to trash early before it even deleted. So Facebook and Instagram and probably anywhere else I make an account. Unless it's legal stuff. And it's some kind, some kind of book username. Like if I was an author for a book, I'm not telling that one because I don't need that one. But yeah, even my LinkedIn. Now going back on the subject about my mom doing makeup videos, she now, well, she used to be an Avon lady back in the '90s, '80s, I think. I know it was '90s because I can remember that far. I didn't really start gathering memories until the 90s, even though I was born in the late 80s. But she now works for Luminous. She wants me to buy her stuff, but I like NYX, and it's cheaper. It's the... She has the... I may try the foundation, at least, because it's the... I, the um, airbrush type, which is really cool. People who work with movies use that. And I've been in a few movies too, TV shows. So they do use that. So if anybody wants airbrush makeup, send me a message and I'll send you to my mom. <laughs> she needs some customers right now. We all need all the support we can get. All of the struggling, struggling artists. Now we're all struggling artists, artists during this stupid pandemic. I was ready for a zombie apocalypse, not hiding. I'm not really much of a hider that much. I'll fight for what I believe in. All right. Now the one thing that irks me about people and foundation, or well, putting on makeup in general, they will use their fingers sometimes and it irks me so bad. Do you realize how much dirt and yuck is on your fingers? Most likely the same people who use their fingers are people who don't wash their hands. Like, ew. Gross. It's also important to wash your brushes. After this, I'm filming a video for cleanliness. That's when I'll be washing my brushes after. And I'll show you properly how to do it if you don't have the stuff. It's also good to wash this too. I can be bad at it. We're all bad at it, but... <sighs> to fly a rocket ship, you need to Hold be on. Ads. When it's free, you gotta have ads, I guess. Okay. This is Haunting Highlights Revelation? Revolution. Revelations. It feels like Revelations right now. I'm almost out of it, but I got it during Halloween. It's a um, highlighter. I like to use this brush for highlighting. It's angled. Oh, not, not, sort of. It's flat. And sometimes I will use my paintbrushes. Of course, unused brand new paintbrushes, but still. I need to get more of this. I love it. I also got other highlighters. I got a rainbow one, too. Yeah, I wish I can be excited for my birthday being at, it's on a Friday, but all our plans that I had with friends, down the poo hole. <gasps> Did my accent just slip? Sorry. 
focus. You can't take sudden southern out of me. Bless a halt. Still just trying to be as positive as I can be. I'm supposed to be excited for my birthday, spring, upcoming festivals. <sighs> All I can say is a good thing for internet. using my fingers but they're clean I just wash them they smell like rose water I'm I'm just obsessed with anything rose rose water um, rose perfume rose oil I just like the way it smells oh eyeshadow yeah it's a little dirty from last time but clean that. This is actually um, cucumber melon, I think, or is it just cucumber? That's another favorite scent of mine. It's a clean scent. Most makeup is oil-based, so sometimes when cleaning up an oil spill uh, makeup mess um, it's good to use an oil and most of your favorite make makeup companies do sell it the um, detergent for brushes brush cleaner makeup brushes my mom even got that stuff hit her up come on she's got She's got all kinds of neat shit. Alright. I think I'm going to go with usual. Start with red. I love red. Can't tell. But red. Red. There's a red dread right here. One side. Red. Hat. <laughs> red. Actually, I like scarlet the most. I like a crimson. Not just fire engine red, but yeah. Red. <laughs> red nail. <laughs> Alright, I'm going to put it under my eye first. Ow. Be careful not, not to poke your waterline. You will cry. Since it is airy season, I'm going to do like a fire. Oops. It fell. The camera fell.
know why, but this one kind of reminds me of Burzum. <laughs> It is like dark ambience music. <laughs> okay. <sighs> All right. Switching colors, I like to clean it off first too. I think I'm gonna go with the gold first and that yeah, no wait. I'm gonna go with that dark dark like bruisy purple first. Or should I go ashes? Ashes is like this color. It's black, but it's it reminds me of soot. Like ashes. Like the ashes the Phoenix rose from. I stay away from that. go with the bruisy purple. Not many people know, but I do like purple as well. Like a dark purple. And that, uh, um, I really don't like blue at all. Indigo's cool. Um, but I do like this beautiful emerald green, or like that slithering green. You know what I'm talking about, Harry Potter fans. It's, it's so pretty. Yeah, this is good. See, it's like a bruisey purple. The lighting in here is terrible. What I'm using is this and the natural light up from outside. with this but I'd rather just record a video because then I can pause it and restart <sighs> edit I need to find a good video editing program along with lights and stuff I can't find one I can find tons for my phone but none for my computer I'd rather work on my laptop with that instead of squinting on my phone it's making my eyes real bad I'm not going anywhere other than making this video. It's the only reason why I'm wearing, putting on makeup to make this video and then to make the other one after. Add. enough for purple. Maybe a little more dab. Dude, it only sucks about this color is it's the hardest to clean. That's why I was hesitant. And now there's a spot. the brushes but I don't know where they are I cleaned out a bag and shit I don't know where I put them <laughs> hopefully somewhere safe Damn. oh well and 
again with the gold. Many people will ask, why don't I have eyebrows? Well, it's because it gives me more canvas space on my face. Yes, I just called my face a canvas. Because it is. I'm an artist. Anything I do is art to me. I could be cooking. I could be simply making a sandwich. It's art. Shit. When I would make sandwiches for my children, I put a little face on it. And they love it. Of course, my son's like, make it look like a dinosaur. All right. My daughter's like, make it look like a kitty. Meow, meow. So I make it look like a kitty. I miss those times. I talk to them. I give them presents. I've been broke lately, so they're gonna, if I can, probably give them a good bundle for uh, Easter, I guess. Oh, that's another thing that's popping up, Easter. True story, whenever my birthday is on a Sunday, I'd have to share it with the Easter Bunny. True story, which is pretty cool. I get a bunny cake. But my favorite cake, true story, is red velvet. Why? It's red. And I like cream cheese. The cream cream cheese cheese. And it basically is just dyed chocolate cake. It used to be made with, um, uh, beets, I think, for the food coloring. But they stopped doing it and just go straight up food coloring. cake. Yeah, that was part of the plan. Oh, well. Oh, I hate that y'all can't see it. Ugh. Not even when I take a picture it shows up good. You gotta see it in person. Which a lot of my friends had the privilege of seeing. Feels like I need to put more of something else. NYX Cosmetics. This one is called, this was the steampunk line, Ignite. The warm colors. They had some good red colors in here. Kind of miss when they had uh, the Sabrina one released. It kept selling out and every time they opened it, it's like, oh, well, we got it, but I have no money. Okay. Meow meow. <sighs> Am I doing? This is kind of the same bruisey purple, but it has a lot more shimmer to it.
It almost dropped. Always blot. Do not wipe. Blot. You have a better chance of a bigger. Not having a bigger mistake. Here's the trick that I'm gonna do. I don't have blush per se, but what I like to do is this. Just follow your jawline. Tip. Just a tip. You want to start bright, but because you're going to blend after. piano music I just realized. I have I do have musical skill. It's piano and I want to learn the electronic violin. Well I gotta learn regular first. Now watch me blend. washable makeup wipes. Alright, now, Doll Eye by NYX Cosmetics. This should be sponsored by NYX Cosmetics. <laughs> now, I would do the falsies right now, but I really don't feel like it. Maybe I'll do one when I'm really about to go out somewhere. If I have the time. poke myself. No? no? Called myself out on it and it don't even happen. 
Oh, I did make a mistake though. Oh well. Wouldn't be hard if it wasn't a mistake. A beautiful mistake. Happy little accidents. <laughs> eyeliner, the epic eyeliner. Some girls do it differently. I used to squeeze my eye like this to put it on, but I've gotten used to doing it this way. does it differently. You don't have to do it like me. Don't get frustrated. Find your neck of how to do it. New stitches. Dot. And the same on the side. Now, here is all right, my signature little heart. It's basically like signing my artwork. Many people ask me, why do I always do it? Every makeup look concludes that heart. Well, originally, where it came from, Emily Autumn. I got it from her. True story. She had the heart where it would actually, like a spider, would come from the eye makeup and then it'd be a heart. She actually colored hers too. But um, she stopped after a while. And then now I'm noticing other girls are doing it. Like, even um, Ash Costello did. She actually did this heart with one of her makeup looks a couple of years ago. I can't remember what era it was. But I think it's cool because in the end, I ended up copying... I didn't copy. It was just completely by accident that we became red and black half-heads. But, true story... Her, her red side was orange first. Now, this is NYX Vivid Brights, the eyeliner, and Vivid Fire. Ah, fire. Ugh. Get, there you go. There also is just eyeliner that's just plainly marked red. I'll get that later. This. Okay, I used to do my eyebrows with the Epic Eyeliner, but I've been doing, since I've been bleaching, um, I've been doing red eyebrows. Oh. Sometimes I like to thicken the first part. People say maybe I should get these permanent. <laughs> to be honest, <laughs> the tattoo pin I have is for permanent makeup. But it's just a needle point is the gauge. It's basically as small as a sewing needle. <laughs> Even smaller than most sewing needles. So 
I'm not gonna, I don't put tattoos on my face. I mean, why? You put foundation on, it covers it or make, dulls it out and you have to do it again. So what? I like having a clear blank canvas to work with every day when putting on makeup. And yes, I know Harley Quinn had the heart on her cheek too. Emily had it first. And I'm sticking to it. A lot of her Ophelic world wait, wayward Victorian girl girls era is my favorite era for her. And I've been completely inspired by that. I continue it, even though now she dresses like a 1920s flapper nowadays, with gold dresses and gold hair. She even does a gold heart now, but, and got stitches here. <sighs> a Victorian industrial, or industrial Victorian, I can't remember which way it goes, but it's basically, to describe it shortly, if the apocalypse happened in the Victorian era, and I'm glad it didn't. <laughs> But it's almost the same as steampunk, only in steampunk, it's a lot of rust, rust and browns. I don't like brown. Rust is cool because it's still a red, but nah. Or dolly goth for me. Dolly goth can be confused with Lolita, but Lolita, I only really like one anime, and it seems like you have to be into anime. Or do an anime character to like Lolita. Lolita also has a bad. It's like the the meaning of Lolita also has a bad meaning too. I hate that it means that too because it does sound cute, but kawaii means cute. <sighs> what else? Oh yeah, this is the basic. My basic. I know it's. But, if I was going out somewhere, sometimes what I like to do is this. I love doing this. It's very Viking, tribal, cyber goth. Let's go. Sometimes I'll take the red, sometimes I'll take the black. Sometimes I'll even put stitches in it. Okay, let's go with something more like this. Sometimes I even put stuff around my mouth, but not right now. Maybe for another time when I'm actually going out again. And sometimes I'll do like a Harley Quinn clown, uh, whatever thing here. This, what I'm about to do is inspired by A lot. And sometimes I'll go up with it. But this right here is inspired by the crow. Some some Harley Quinn makeups. Um another one too.
sometimes a joker. Mostly in, to do with clowns, actually. Shit. Somebody who is in, well, was in a freak show. He still sorts. Bleh. Swallow swords. But he uses it as the third eye opening or something. Open minded and stuff like that. Open your eyes before your mouth. Yeah. But this is totally me with the stitches. I'm like the only one that still does that. I also do this. Little very fairy esque put some stitches. Now that turning myself into a rag doll and using the method of stitches as my type of doll and they would be tattooed. Now that is what I'm getting tattooed permanently. I don't put foundation on my arms. <laughs> Eventually I may get one, some on my neck, but. Okay. Lips. My favorite is a red or a black. I can find it. I also got a purple. I'm This is cute though. This is actually from Ultra. Metallic. Maybe I'll use this one, even though I do got their lipstick. I got this, this red. It is the Red Queen. Yeah, Red Queen. Ro Rouge Royale. Oh no. But I'm going to go with this. It actually is called Mixed Emotions. <laughs> it's a metallic red. Same. Metallic. Red. Sometimes I'll do the uh, doll lips. Sometimes, most of the time. But mm, only sometimes the most prominent. And I don't know how many young girls do this, but I like to put the little heart on my top lips. A very pouty, luscious, whatever you want to call it, type lips. So much so, my natural stance for them is like this. So, got all this. Right here, that can be sweat prone, prone, and then I got the lip ring. So, and I like lipsticks that have this to it. It's harder, cause uh, have to do this. <laughs> 